Hello, Cordell here, and welcome to my week four presentation for my server side languages course here at Full Sail University. Um, again, this is week four, this is assignment number four, and today we're going to be looking at um, using the AJAX method for authorization pages, um, processing a form so we can look at the positive feedback and errors that will pop up when validating forms. So if you look into the code right here, I added a contact um, received page. This will be um, when it, everything plugs in and it's successful, then this page will pop up. In the contact page, I made a lot of um, just different options you can choose as far as inputs go for um, form fields and whatnot. So I'm going to pull it up on the browser and make it full screen for you guys. <clears throat> so as you can see, this is we're in the contact page right now. And if you try to submit, it won't let you submit. And then boom, all of the errors will pop up. And as you can see, there's a lot of errors because obviously nothing is filled in. So if we go ahead and, and fill everything in, um, let's see, I'll just do Steve Rogers and then Instagram, you can put, you know, Tony Stark or whatever. Email, put whatever email you want. Oh, obviously it autofills now, but anyways. Password, you can make it up. Um, you have to confirm the password as well. And then see, it doesn't match. It recognizes that. <coughs> Then you can rate a movie or whatever, leave your comment. Um, agree to terms and conditions or else it won't let you. Um, favorite superhero, Captain America. Iron Man's pretty cool though, they're equally cool. <laughs> and then check yourself before you wreck yourself. And then you can submit. And then when it submits, as you can see, you get the success. And if you want to, you can log in. And as you can see, I made it so it would focus in on the username and password up top. So I will do the already programmed username and password and I'll sign in. And as you can see, you have your profile and logout options available now. If you go to profile, um, obviously nothing's styled yet, but it will show you all your progress on your profile. Then you can log out. Go back to contact, um, just for another example, is our Ajax request. This is for when uh, the, it's already pre-programmed with the correct email. So for example, if I do the Ajax submit, it will say the login is incorrect because obviously there's not any emails, but even if I did like this email, Ajax submit, it's the login is incorrect because I pre-plugged in uh, what the correct email should be, which is mike at aol.com. So we'll try it again. I'm going to refresh the page. So now when I do mike at aol.com, I'm going to do the Ajax submit and then it's going to welcome. And to prove that it is working like it's supposed to, we can go to the network. And let's, let's just do it again. Ajax submit, welcome, here it is. Welcome. And then if you don't do it cor correctly, excuse me, if you don't do it correctly, you know, put in whatever, obviously the email is invalid, but if you do Ajax submit, the login is incorrect, and then boom, error on submit, please fill out fields correctly. And that's just an example of the Ajax submit when uh, the, load, the data is already preloaded. Right. And that is it. Thank you very much.